Greetings. Welcome to Rensselaer and welcome to the 21st Black Family Technology Awareness Day. My name is John Wexer and I am the Vice President of Enrollment Management at Rensselaer and co-chair along with my colleague, Dr. Lee McElroy for the planning committee for this day. First, on behalf of everyone at Rensselaer, we hope you and your family are safe. Second, as you can imagine, this year's event will be different as it's completely virtual. You should know that we have students from all over the country and all over the world participating today. We have a great day planned for you, students and parents, with number of workshops taking place that you'll be able to participate in all virtually. You may know that Rensselaer is the oldest technology research university in the United States. Today we are top 50 nationally ranked research university and we have students from all 50 states in over 40 countries studying on campus. Our motto is why not change the world? Our president, Dr. Shirley Ann Jackson, has done just this. Since coming to Rensselaer in 1999, she has led an extraordinary transformation of the Institute. We have over a billion dollars in new and updated research facilities for our campus students and hired over 300 tenured faculty and seen an increase in our applications by over 400%. She has been described by Time Magazine as perhaps the ultimate role model for women in science. Dr. Jackson is a theoretical physicist. She holds an SB in physics and a PhD in theoretical elementary particle physics, both from MIT, where she was the first African-American woman to receive a doctoral degree in any field. Prior to taking the helm at, our, at Rensselaer, she, has, she was chairman of the U.S. Nuclear Regulatory Commission from 1995 to 1999, where she was appointed by President Bill Clinton. She serves or has served on boards of major corporations such as FedEx and IBM. She is a former member of the board of the World Economic Forum. In 2016, President Barack Obama awarded her the National Medal of Science. This is the highest national honor in science and engineering a person can get. In 2018, Dr. Jackson was awarded the W.E. Du Bois Medal from the Hutchinson Center for African American and African American Research at Harvard University. This medal goes to those who have made significant contributions to African and African American history, culture, and more broadly. Individuals who advocate for intercultural and human rights in increasingly global and interconnected world. Oh, did I mention she also has 55 honorary degrees. Please help me welcome the 18th president of Rensselaer Polytechnic Institute, Dr. Shirley Ann Jackson. 